Howdy fellas, Uncle Sasquatch and Jake. We're going to take a look today at another fine replication by the folks down Tennessee Valley Muzzle Loaded in Natchez, Mississippi. And this is their interpretation of a southern rifle. It has a 42 inch long, 40 caliber barrel, uh, siler lock, Davis double set triggers, and iron furniture. And it also has a super premium maple stock with about 80-90% curl. And it's a really piece of wood, nice piece of wood. And it's stained in red. Some people call it ox blood, English red. But I really like that color on the gun. Now there's a lot of debate out there about southern rifles. Uh, some people say it was just a marketing ploy. But if you look back through the history of rifles, you had your Pennsylvania rifles, Buck County, Lancaster, what have you, which were either Germanic or a combination of Germanic and English styles, whereas your southern rifles were mostly of an English style. Uh, that's because the, the, the uh, ancestry of the settlers of the area were Scots, Irish, and Irish people, so it tended to have the English influence. So, <clears throat> it's a really good looking rifle. Guys down at Tennessee Valley Muzzleloader do a great job. If you're in the market for a muzzleloader, give them a call. They'll help you out, help you pick out whatever rifle you'd like to have built. I hope you've had a Merry Christmas. And I hope you're looking forward to a happy, prosperous, and healthy new year. As always, thank you for watching. Keep your powder dry. Mind your top knot, Pilgrim.